key cells in the brain, called neurons, make it possible for us to think, communicate, and experience the world. And when neurons die because of illness or injury, serious diseases such as a stroke, Alzheimer's, and Parkinson's disease can result. Now, University of Florida researchers have discovered a way to isolate neurons from other brain cells grown from neurostem cells. The new discovery will help researchers in efforts to transplant pure populations of neurons into the brain that may restore proper brain function after injury or disease. But these are the neurons. Experts say this technology could help researchers develop the proper dose of neurons to transplant into the brain to replace dead or damaged cells. When it comes to cell therapy, we need to be able to dose our therapeutic drug, our therapeutic molecule. In this case, it's the neurons, because it's the neurons that we want to replace the neurons that are lost to injury and disease. People who suffer from neurodegenerative disorders and other brain injuries may one day benefit from neural stem cell transplants. Whether it's going to work or not is still has yet to be seen. I think this technology is going to increase the chances or increase the probability that transplantation is going to show efficacy. Researchers say cell replacement through transplantation is moving rapidly from the research labs to clinical trials. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Billowich.